And then I, I suppose the other, one other point I really liked was you talked about the importance of your network rather than the sort of the company hierarchy. And I'm sure for a lot of people, I remember when I, I was starting how it work, you're thinking, okay, I've joined this company, you know, I, I've got my boss and I really need to make sure that I, I make a good impression on him and the other people in the department. But actually, I think you know, nowadays, as we were talking about, it's really your sort of network, that sort of flat structure of people that, look, if things happen and you lose your job, they're the people who, you know, potentially have intelligence for you about new opportunities or help you out or just, you know, be, be there to you know, give you ideas. Um, don't you think so? The idea that professional loyalty now flows horizontally to your network as opposed to vertically up the corporate hierarchy, uh, I think is really powerful. And maybe it's a not an instead, but like certainly if you're in a company and working your way up, you have to manage your own stakeholders and manage up and down. But um, increasingly companies are you know, sort of a smaller core of people, and then a lot of people you can collaborate with on the outside. And so it's not just knowing a lot of people, in my opinion, um, it's also taking those um, small bets to collaborate with other people and taking opportunities to work with people to see it, you know, how you work and how, how well you work with other people and, um, and even just you know, different ways to collaborate and volunteering or, um, you know, having a podcast together, whatever it is, I think is really, is really fun and interesting. And those are the relationships that uh, ultimately maybe get you a job or maybe get you a consulting gig, uh, or maybe you're on the inside of the core team and you're pulling other people in. But even if you're inside your company and you know all these people that do amazing things that you can pull in, that's a huge talent. Having that network for your company that you're working for is something that companies are now looking for. Um, so yes, I think it's an incredible, being strategic about your network is something that I teach people, even at the highest level, even the ones that are like, I'm a CEO now, I want to be a board director. You know, we look at their network and who needs to be kind of activated uh, in order to see if they can do the things they want to do.